What is up guys, welcome back to another video on the channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a free YouTube banner uh, without having to use Photoshop. If you guys do find this video helpful, make sure to drop a like. Also, if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and turn post notifications so you guys won't miss out on any future videos I post. Now with that being said, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so the first thing you want to do is go to pixlr.com. I'm going to leave the link in the description. Uh, once you're here, go ahead and click on create a new image. Uh, for the width and height, we're going to do 2560 by 1440. Now the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and get the YouTube banner template. I already have it on my computer. If you guys don't have it, I'm gonna leave a link in the description so you guys can download it. Now in order to open an image in Pixlr, what you wanna do is go ahead and click on layer, open image as layer, and we're gonna go ahead and get the template, it's right here. And this is how it's supposed to look. Uh, pretty much what the template does, it shows you uh, the text safe area. So like, let's say if I write something and it passes these lines right here, uh, you won't be able to see them. Now the next thing you wanna do is we're gonna go ahead and add a new layer. So go ahead and click right here. And we're gonna go ahead and click on the drawing tool and make sure fill shape is checked. Uh, we're gonna use the color black and we're gonna go ahead and make it rectangle right here, starting from up here. Bring it down all the way, like so. And we're gonna do the same thing in the bottom. Now, once you're done with that, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and uh, type your channel name. So go ahead and click on the type tool. And we're gonna make the size uh, 500. For the font, we're gonna use, uh, I think we're gonna use American Captain. And for the color, we're gonna change it to white. Click okay. And then just go ahead and type your channel name. Go ahead and click OK. And now we're gonna go ahead and move it. And I think we're gonna make it a little bit smaller. So uh, right click, rasterize layer. And then we're gonna go to edit, free transform. Uh, make sure you hold shift when you're resizing an image. You guys can see, uh, I think we're gonna make it, about, that's a good size right there. Hit enter. And now we're gonna go ahead and get a background for our banner. Uh, I already chose one as a Fortnite background. So uh, if you guys want this image, um, just go ahead and type Fortnite background in Google and you should be able to get it. So we'll, in order to open an image, we go to layer, open image as layer and the Fortnite wallpaper is right here. We're gonna go ahead and uh, make it a little bit bigger. So edit, free transform. Hold shift and I think that should be good right there. I think that's good right there. Hit enter. And now we're gonna move our wallpaper uh, right under layer two. You guys can see it should look like this. And we're gonna move it a little bit. I think that's cool right there. Um, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and add a stroke to our uh, text. So uh, go ahead and right click, layer styles. We're gonna hit outer glow. For the hardness, bring it up to 10. For the size, we're gonna do 10 as well. And for the color, we're gonna change it to black. Click okay. And okay. And as you can see, you could see the text a little bit better. Now, the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and add a Fortnite character. Or I chose the Dark Bomber. Uh, you guys can choose any character you guys want. Go ahead and click Layer, Open Image as Layer, and we're gonna go ahead and open up the Dark Bomber. You guys can see it's a little bit too big. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and click Edit, Free Transform, Hold Shift, and that's good right there make it a little bit smaller right there click enter and we're gonna go ahead and bring 
um, our layer 5 right under layer 2. You guys can see this how it's gonna look. And yeah, once you're done with that, uh, we're gonna go ahead and change the color of our background a little bit. So go ahead and click on layer 4, which is your wallpaper. And we're gonna go to adjustment, hue and saturation. Um, I think 45 is pretty good. So bring it up to 45, saturation. And then for saturation, we're gonna do it 100. And lightness, just leave it like that. And go ahead and click okay. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and add our a Twitter logo and a Twitch logo. So I already have mine. Uh, if you go to Google, you could type in Twitter logo PNG and you should be able to get it. So we're gonna go to layer, open image as layer, uh, get the Twitter logo. And we're gonna resize it. So we go to edit, free transform. Make sure you hold shift and make it a little bit smaller. I think that's a good size right there. And we're gonna put it up here, enter. And we're gonna go ahead and add a stroke to it as well. So right click, layer styles, uh, outer glow, hardness, we're gonna bring it up to 10. For the color, we're gonna change it to black. Click okay, okay. And now we're gonna add the Twitch logo, so layer. Open image as layer, the Twitch logo, edit, free transform, hold shift. Hit enter. And we're gonna add a stroke too. So right click, layer styles, outer glow. Uh, bring it up to 10, change the color to black. Click OK and OK. Now we're going to go ahead and write your uh, Twitter name and your Twitch name. So go to the text tool. Uh, we're going to bring this down a little bit to 174. And for the font. We're going to use I think for the font we're going to use American Captain as well so at Twitter make sure you change it to white click OK OK and then uh, we're going to make it a little bit smaller so you're going to right click Rasterize layer and then you go to edit free transform make sure you hold shift and Go ahead and make it smaller Go ahead and click enter and then we're gonna add a stroke so right click layer style uh, outer glow hardness up to 10 change the color to black click ok ok and we're gonna do the same thing for Twitch. All right, so once you're done with your banner and you think it looks good, uh, in order to save it, you go to File, Save. Uh, make sure to change the format to PNG. Uh, name it whatever you guys want. Go ahead and click OK. So I'm going to just name it Banner. And then click Save. 
And yeah, guys, this is how you make a YouTube banner for free without having to use any expensive programs like Photoshop. So hopefully you guys did find this video helpful. If you guys did, make sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.